there is an urgent demand for solutions that range from environmental sustainability to urban mobility, and the use of high-strength materials enables a reduction in the total material used in construction. Lighter structures and lower CO2 emissions are achieved when using high-strength material, without jeopardizing the safety of the structure, which justifies the trend to increase strength in steels used in construction in recent years. The small additions of niobium to steel causes refinement of the microstructure and the grain size, resulting in an increase of yield and tensile strength, while preserving the ductility and elongation of structural steels. As a result, the structures can be lighter while maintaining the safety of the project and improving the longevity of the structures. But how does niobium act in the steel? Niobium has a strong inhibiting effect on recrystallization during hot rolling. In solution or as precipitates, niobium acts as a barrier for the movement and rearrangement of the grains that are continuously deformed during the hot rolling process. As a result, the as rolled material exceeds the hot rolling mill with finer grains. In this condition, the final phases that will be transformed at cooling after the exit from the hot rolling will be finer as well. Compared with the other microalloying elements, smaller amounts of niobium are more effective for stopping recrystallization, leading to smaller grain sizes in the final microstructure. Even in additions below 0.02%, niobium can improve the properties of plain carbon manganese steels, meeting standards that could only be met by special alloyed materials. The microalloying concept guarantees excellent mechanical properties with competitive costs and the additions are minimal. Niobium bearing steels also have excellent welding performance. During welding, niobium precipitates and inhibits grain growth at heat-affected zones, preventing the occurrence of brittle phases during cooling of welded areas, which is very important to guarantee high toughness in these zones.